It is for freedom that Christ has made you free. What do we do? <laughs> we do what God does best. We open our hearts for a fresh baptism of his love. He's so good at baptizing. The Holy Spirit came to baptize us with his love and his presence and his power. And we live, I talked about it before, I go out in my backyard and when all my kids bring their dogs over, there's five of them. And they're big dogs. And they live, leave puddles of poo everywhere. And I can go out in my backyard that didn't have any poo before. And I'm walking along, I was cleaning it up the other day, just cleaning it up. And I thought, man, what is that terrible smell? I look down, it's all over my sandal, my $49 sandals. And I could go all day long and wear that sandal with poo on it. And go, I'm so offended with those dogs. I'm thinking, I'm gonna make some rules. They can't come and poo in my yard anymore. In fact, I'm gonna tell my kids, those, those dogs can't come over anymore. I've got living proof of what they've done. Truth, truth be told, that's what we do when we don't forgive, when we don't allow God's grace to be poured out in our hearts. For those who offend us, those who wound us, those CNN isn't our enemy. Fox News isn't our enemy. Do they have agendas? Everybody's got an agenda, but our agenda is to be in love with Jesus. Our agenda is to have the heart of the Father. Our agenda is to bring the grace and the goodness of God. And today, this morning, this evening, maybe it's midnight where you're watching, whatever time of day you can come and open your heart and receive God's grace, receive God's mercy, confess your sins, ask Jesus to come to forgive you, to cleanse you this morning. Let his love pour out over your hearts.